to this tutorial where I will show you the basics of setup, downloading, and initialization of data from the Actigraph Activity Monitors. In order to initialize your device, unscrew the black knob on the side of the Activity Graph Monitor. This will reveal the USB port, which you will plug in to the computer. Once the activity monitor is plugged in and charging, it will have a green light that blinks. Once it is completely charged, the light will stay green. The activity monitors take approximately three hours to charge completely. After you plug in the Actigraph monitors, you will see that they appear in the main screen of the Actilife software. Make sure that the arrow to the left of the device is checked for the monitors you wish to initialize. Note that the device must have at least 80% battery life in order to be initialized. Next, click the Initialize button and select the appropriate type of initialization. This will prompt a new window to open where you will select the des desired data collection parameters, otherwise default parameters will be used. Here you will enter the dates and times when the device should start and stop collecting data. If no stop time is selected, data will be collected until the battery is depleted. This is also the screen where you can enable wireless if you plan to use Bluetooth capabilities, including a compatible heart rate monitor. Now, enter the subject name, information, and the where position details into the grid. Select Initialize One Device and a progress bar will indicate when initialization is complete. Once it is complete, unplug the monitor and replace the USB cap. When you're ready to give the monitor to a patient, you're going to want to set it up with one of the straps. There's a waist strap and a wrist strap option. For the wrist strap, thread the small end of the strap into one of the wings on the monitor. Bring the strap all the way through, then thread the small end again into the other wing, just slightly, enough so that the patient can then slip it on their wrist and tighten the strap, fastening it with the Velcro. For the waist-worn strap, make sure that the strap is threaded through both the wings on the monitor so that it lies flat on the back of the monitor. Instruct the patient to put it on so that it is in line with their armpit and their knee. It should be clipped in the back and worn just like a belt. After the device has been worn for the desired amount of time, you are ready to download the data. Open the Actilife software, then plug in the monitor. Verify that the box next to the device is checked and select Download from the menu. This will open a dialog box that will display the download options. Here you will want to select the file download location, name the file, and edit the user information. Once the download options are selected, click Download All Devices. When the download is complete, a finished downloading link will appear. The data has now been successfully downloaded and can be scored using the analysis tools in Actilife. This concludes the tutorial on the setup, initialization, and downloading of the Actigraph monitors. Thank you for watching.